everybody. I'm Reverend Dave. I'm the pastor here at the United Methodist Church at Epsecon. Today, I want to invite you to come and worship with us tomorrow on Sunday morning. Our Sunday morning begins at 9 o'clock with a contemporary style worship service. This has a live praise band. It has a Young Disciples moment with me. It has lots of great live praise music. And of course, it has many great disciples of Christ to come and learn with, to be with, and to pray with. After that, at 9.45, we have Sunday School. Our Sunday School is actually for all ages. So if you are a young disciple, we have a class for you with other children your age. If you are an adult but still are looking for some Christian education opportunities, we have those for you also on Sunday morning as an adult Sunday School class meets at about 10 o'clock. And then at 11 o'clock, we have our traditional worship service in our sanctuary with an organ and a choir even more great disciples to be with and learn with and pray with. So friends, if you come on this Sunday, we want to let you know what we'll be talking about. We want to let you know what the scripture is so you can, if you want, to begin to look at that now. Think about it now. and Ask some questions to yourself now and get yourself ready for what we'll be talking about tomorrow. Tomorrow we'll be reading from the Gospel of John, chapter 21, verses 15 through 19. And this is the moment when Jesus appears to Peter on the Sea of Galilee. So in his final appearance before ascending into heaven, the resurrected Jesus gives Peter one last important message about what discipleship looks like. Discipleship is about action. So in this series of if-then situations that Jesus gives Peter, Jesus says to Peter, if you love me, then you'll do this. If you love me, you'll take care of the things that I love. Discipleship is about action. Actions of love that take care of the things that Jesus loves. People. All people. That same message is given to us now. If we are to be true disciples of Christ, we too have to take care of all of the people that God loves. Friends, we hope that you will worship with us tomorrow. We hope to see you there. If you can't come here in person, we always have a virtual option that you can worship with us on Facebook, YouTube, AbSeekNUMC.com, or our AbSeekNUMC app. One way or another, friends, we hope to worship with you this coming Sunday. Peace and blessings, and see you soon. Bye-bye.